are you embracing fear or are you embracing the beginning of mediocrity? Hey everybody, keynote motivational speaker Dave the Chef Sheffield coming at you with a gorgeous sunrise motivational video this morning. I am so terrified of the future. I tell you what, this time of year, right now we're in, in the fall season in the Northern Hemisphere right now, and in North America anyway, many children are going back to school, and understandably, they have some anxieties, especially if they're starting a new school, or hey, you know, will I make any new friends, or whatever, you know, they're very uh, timid or apprehensive, if you will. And unfortunately, a lot of times, as adults, we don't grow out of that. We grow so comforted by our surroundings that we're afraid to grow. So how do those super high achievers, how do those people that really crush it in life do it? One, they believe and understand that, hey man, there's some fear, there's some anxiety, and it is part of the journey. In life, we are teetering out on this ledge between what we know and what we do not know. And all learning is, folks, is simply embracing all these surrounding things, whether they're inside of a classroom, outside of the classroom, in relationships or what have you, embracing those and kind of putting them into this little cauldron of learning. So you understand that there's this ledge of uncertainty and leverage the ledge as best you possibly can. The second thing that they do is, man, they dig down and they are willing to crush it in every single way that they possibly can. Look, if you are drawing a breath right now, God put you here for a reason. You know, there's nothing that is more soul crushing than watching somebody settle. Settle for crappy relationships or settle for less than they possibly can be or, or what have you. And we all go through seasons where we settle and that's how we know that it sucks. So, my challenge to you is what's one thing, one, what's one way that you can unwrap this wonderful gift that God has given you today in the present? And the third thing that they do is they absolutely track, monitor, and continue to pivot. Track, monitor, and continue to pivot. Hey, we're gonna try this, and you know, for longer than a day or longer than a weekend, but by gosh, we're gonna try this until we succeed or until we understand that maybe we're heading in the wrong direction and we need to pivot and head in a little bit different direction, a tangent, if you will. Maybe we bring in some outside experts to shine a light of. Um, of a different perspective on us. Hey, let me know what you think of this video. Make sure you share it on uh, any of your social media channels and subscribe if you will. Hey, I'm looking forward to speaking at your next convention, meeting or event. Until next time, always better your best. Take care.